lot of speculations uh, that Playboy Cardi <sighs> took took a lot of your uh, style. Is that is that just rumors going through out the industry? Or Ain't a damn that rumor. Ain't a rumor, man. That's what that is. Just like okay, look, it's how how this nigga saying everybody. It's it's the Pierre wave right now. Pierre born. Now everybody wanna go fuck with him. I know he's not fucking with this shit because he said something about it. But that's how it was with me. I came out with the plug wave. I had Miss Kojo, I had Stupid Cool, I had Polo Boy, I had the whole plug. I came out, and they really made, they tried to make controversy with the shit. It was like, nigga, he came out, he did the same song that I did, like this, the same beat. But he had Ian Connor behind him, you know what I'm saying? I, I ain't had nobody behind me, you know what I'm saying? I ain't no, co like I said, I ain't no co sign around here, so. Shit, he came out with that shit. With that, I had, what was the name of that hoe? Flexed up. I had to flex up. Yeah. That hoe still up to this day, like two, three years old. Then he had that beat. Then I had came out with the Miss Kojo. I did Miss Kojo first project, the first mixtape, his first mixtape and all that. He had no big credits like that mm -hmm. when I was working with him. I had, when, I, when I was working with him, right. I found him on YouTube. He didn't have no credits. He, he was selling beats for like $15. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I did that shit. He started going hard. Then that's when Playboy Carter came out. The next year. The next year. And he came out, it was like a little 15 second video on, uh, Inst I mean not Instagram, on Twitter. They was tagging me in that shit. They was like, who is this? Who is this? And they was coming out of little apartments or whatever, and he come on, and the song come on. I told him that's a girl about I'm that. like, who the fuck is that? You know what I'm saying? Like, who the fuck is this nigga? He didn't even know about him. He didn't even know about him. That's what I'm saying. Then, then nobody know about him. And so then you feel shit. like Playboy Cardi was watching you the whole time? I feel like on some real shit, I feel like these niggas like grew up off me or something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, cause it's, 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 you know what I'm saying? Niggas thought I was from Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these niggas thought I was from Atlanta. So shit, like funny them, funny. You know, I, they're my boys. You know what I'm saying? When, they, when I first started talking to them, they was like, bro, we thought you was from the A. You know what I'm saying? You thought you was from the A. Knowing, y'all know, Funny, Uno, Cardi, they all together. They've been together. So how you ain't hear about them? You know what I'm saying? How you ain't hear? Yachty, they all grew up together. So how you ain't hear about them? You know what I'm saying? It's just that, and I don't hate on good music. You feel me? I don't hate on good music. Yeah, he got, he got some shit. He got a couple songs out for it, but it's like, Everybody else come and be like, yeah, we fool. I ain't saying he gotta come and fool with me, like, you know what I'm saying? But don't act like you out here just making shit up, and it's just you. And you got everybody looking at me like I'm stealing. It. That ain't what that was. That's not what that is. Like, nah. So have you met him before? I seen him before. And y'all like been in the same room or something? Yeah. I remember he had a show with Rocky. Man, Rocky. ASAP. They came and they came and found us first. That's what I said, before Cardi came before out. out. Before he even came out, I was we was hanging with ASAP Rocky. Yeah. I was hanging with ASAP Rocky. Yeah, like 20. That was way 13, back. 2013. 2013. I've been I was been fucking with niggas. I've been turning down deals. I turned down the Interscope deal like two years ago. Like he been I get I don't know what happened with that shit. You know what I'm saying? He told me he wanted he wanted us to come do this shit in the video or whatever. He's gonna fly us out to New York to do it. He ain't never do it. Next thing you know. ASAP. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't hate on him though. He doing his thing. I don't hate on him. I just don't, like I said, I just don't want nobody to think it did. I just don't like the fact that everybody, like, I stole something from him and I sound like him and that ain't what that is. You get that a lot with people, they, they compare y'all? All day long, every day. Man, you go look on YouTube. If people want to make beats that they feel like I'm a rap on, they, it's not going to never be a Diego Money type beat. It's gonna be Diego Money slash Playboy Cardi type beat every time. Like, Miss Kojo, Diego Money, Playboy Cardi type beat. Like, I can't even get away from the shit. Like, get the fuck. <laughs> this young Diego Money, that's it. Only one me, original. The real plug wave. I, mean, I started this shit. I, mean, I started this shit. And the real fans, they know that. That's why I don't really too much trip. Cause now I'm doing my thing. It just took some time, some patience. Being patient. Yeah, Playboy Cardi's one of the biggest artists out right now. Would you say that with the Magnolia record? That hoe going hard. Yeah. I can't stunt. We going hard. He got fucking Cleveland and shit, dancing to that shit. Like I said, I can't handle good music, but shit, that don't mean I gotta like you as a person. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I see that nigga all the time. I got a song together. I got a song with that nigga. But how that came about, 
He did the song. We in the studio. He like, man, we gotta do some shit. We in the studio. I pull up the beat, pull up a franchise beat. He go in there and he dropped up the hook and the verse. And I get on the second verse. You know what I'm saying? We do the song. I come back out here. I get a call. Hey, bro. Hey. See if you can put a say another verse on there. Cardi wanna jump on it. I'm like, Cardi? Why he ain't call me? You know what I'm saying? Like, shit. Everybody else fuck with me and hit me up like, we wanna do it. If you wanna do a song, let me get on that hoe. Like, why he ain't call me? I was just like, whatever. He get on that hoe. You know what I'm saying? Like, me being smart, you feel me? I ain't, I ain't looking into it. I'm just like, shit, it could help me in a way, but shit, he can get on the shit. And he did the song. At first, did nobody even want to send me the shit. You know what I'm saying? Because they like, everything he do, it get, it get leaked or whatever. I'm like, nigga, I ain't gonna leak the song. I'm gonna put it on my tape. Yeah. But he got on it. Somehow, yeah, yeah, yeah. it got leaked. Anyway, it got leaked. I ain't leak it. I still put it on my tape or whatever. It's, it's going up, but that's how the song came about. I still, and when he did it, I ain't never, like I said, I ain't never just actually talk to Cardi. Like, we ain't never had no face-to-face -face conversation. We ain't even had no phone conversation. We don't have none of that. Every time we see each other, it's just, we walk right past each other. You know what I'm saying? Maybe on some shit like that.